Hey guys, welcome back to Vitamin Y. So today is Wednesday, and that means we're using Ubelixes, the new updated version that I have created off of the old version and the Kakashi Kyle's version. So hopefully uh, it puts in that work today. So uh, the deck actually got a change with the new ban list. Uh, definitely one of the key factors in the deck is Armageddon Knight and Dark Graffer. Definitely, definitely, definitely. So of course we had to up that road to two. So what did we decide to take down? I decided to go ahead and drop some threes. And you're probably like, oh, what do you mean, drop some threes? What I mean by drop some threes is that I was uh, running... Who's going first? I think he's going first. Yeah, he's going first. I decided to drop a uh, tour guide down to... Uh, down to... to well, I decided to drop a tour guide in general because I was running two tour guides. So I can go, tour guide, tour guide, okay, I got my threes. But then I was like, oh, I need to up Marota, so I taking out tour guide i need to find a level three was a pretty good level three that's a good standalone card and here he is fucking broken bandit because this deck can do it this is the only deck you know usually i'm not a big fan of uh you know controlled uncontrolled sending but you know just being able to summon him tribute send my five whether it be you bells or any of them all, all the darks i need and then getting back a spell card it's just so fucking powerful with this fucking deck so only this deck though you know, because I would never, ever, ever, ever do it in like Supervice. There's not enough monsters I want to send. There's not enough spells and trap cards that, you know, there's too many trap spells and trap cards. I would just mill them all. So, no. <laughs> I'll go ahead and drop you and... Uh, uh sucks. <laughs> uh, I can do an awesome play. I can do an awesome play coming up, but I definitely need to get a little bit more set up. So, I sent you, so I need to send a... I need to send any 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 card really. I can send you Bell. And then next turn I'm gonna go ahead and summon Armageddon Knight, send uh Steel Swarm Longhorn, and then I can go ahead and message in a bottle my cards back. And when I message in bottle all my cards back, and then I can use my Galaxy Queen's Light, make them all nine, and then I can see right into Heart Earth, who rarely gets summoned, but I think we might be able to summon him. So, if you didn't know the uh the f uh Episode 300 of I'm Wise coming up, and I said at 190, I'm going to go ahead and put up a video, and you guys can go ahead and comment and vote on what deck you want for episode 300, separate from that episode. But another video that day where I would do a deck profile of any, any UL deck, any one that's on I'm in Y. So uh, I don't know, I'm not saying that you should vote for this one, but I don't know. I mean, this deck is, is looking pretty interesting in my opinion, so maybe... So far, he really hasn't committed to any plays. So, whenever, I'm ready to go off. It's just that, you know, Hard Earth isn't that good unless I got something to be doing something with him. So, so I'll just leave that alone for now. So, I drop... I need to drop a... Okay, sure, okay. I was gonna drop Longhorn. I had the play, I had the play, you saw the play. It just kinda sucked that he quit. Nor was he really committing to anything that's really worth me seeing him to. I mean, I, I mean, really, I could have just summoned them all back, made them all ten, because I would have summoned you Bell and made super, super chocolate fudge covered as well. But yeah, so Curry Bandit, just go ahead and summon it, send a whole bunch of monsters, and then if I happen to, you know, send the monsters I want, then it's great. And then I'll go ahead and grab my spell and trap cards back. So I'm picking scissors. I always pick scissors. So you need to change. You know what? Fine, fine, fine. Oh my God. Just pick something! Fine. I don't care. Oh my god. I always pick scissors, though. Fine. I'll go first. I really don't care whether I go first or second, so... Except when I draw fucking you bell like that. So, I'm just gonna summon Krebin's pass. I'll pay the hundreds to block my attack. So that's my level 2 dark. I like to go with Krebin's. Did I put Goyo in here? I don't think I did. Nope. Didn't change it. Didn't change up walking for Goyo. Struggle. Forgot that. I put in the road. I definitely forgot the Goyo. Good job, Daniel. Good job. You had one job. One job. You had one job. And you fuck it up. Good job. Uh-oh. I'm gonna get Pleiades. sucks being on the other end of Pleiades. It really does. It really fucking does. It's just like, god damn it. Okay. Sure, I guess. What effect? 
What effect? If you're trying to summon back the Cyber Dragon, no. No. You have to have a target in grave to to summon. Oh my god. No. 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 You can't detach and then target that same monster. No. If you had another Cyber Dragon in the graveyard, then yes, you could do that. But no, you can't do that. The summon is... The target is not the detach. Same as Lumina. Unless... Unless you already have a target in Grave. <sighs> you can't go Lumina, Lumina Effect, pitch, and get that card back unless you have a Light Sworn already in the Grave. I just select as a different target. I'll use my Effect block. I'll take the 800. Can't believe I fucking forgot to put in Goyo. Which I could be going for this turn. Actually, I could still go for it this turn. I know fucking he'll have the fucking answer. Uh, once per turn, once per turn, do a new play turn. You can banish one cyber dragon from your hand or face up on a monster zone. Okay, so if he has a cyber dragon, then I'm just gonna eat it if I try to go after him with Goyo. But it's a good thing I have don't have Goyo. I have Vulcan. So this turn, I can go ahead and summon Sync Eight. Summon Vulcan. Vulcan bounce himself. Bounce the Cyber Dragon. Effect. And then I have a monster in the graveyard for Mass Chameleon, which will be Phantom of Chaos, of course. So I can do that. But Nodri like shit. Oh, I can limit reverse him and summon back Krebins. Never noticed that. That's cool. So one in pass. Yep, it's probably M end phase MST. Nope. Okay. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Alright, he's getting Dre, which is fine. That's fine. I'll take the 18. I opened up like shit. Of course I drew Ultimate Nightmare. Like, oh my god. There's another limit reverse. Awesome. Well, I definitely know what I'm going to be fucking making this turn. Fucking level a chain out the ass. Like, don't fuck with me. I don't even care if his fucking Dre can come after me. Well, Kamikaze with me. I'm, I'm still going to attack him. I'll, after level a chain sends you battle, I'll be perfectly fine. Also, I want to attack into him so I can get rid of his Dre so he can't make a fucking... Um, Play it this way. Okay. I'm waiting. I mean, if you re if you really want to stop me, I can always activate Let Me Reverse and Summon, so. Okay. Waiting. Let's go ahead and overlay these two into the wall wall chain, of course. There you are. Okay. If you hit me with back row, I there's no such thing as priority. The one time we went with priority. You like ball with no priority effect, detach send no No. There's no priority. Alright, let's go ahead and send you bell. There we go. Now the limit reverse is nice and powerful. I should gotta Something to summon. I'll, I'll kamikaze with you, unless you want to play honest. I will kamikaze with you, unless you want to play honest. Okay. Go ahead. It's better to kill. It's better to kamikaze and take you out with me than leave it on the field. Then you can go ahead and summon something else and make your shit stronger than what I currently have. Because Lava the Chain served his purpose. What a soldier. Thank you, Lava the Chain. I love you. You shall never be forgotten. Wait, who did I just summon last turn? I'm just kidding. 
drop. Oh, you want traps on me? All right, sure, sure, that's fine. Oh wait, wait, let me reverse the stock. Let me reverse the stock. Good. Didn't think it was trap stun face down. Just when I wanted to summon my fucking new bell. Nope. Sub rally. That's fine. Are you going to do sub rally? Okay. Limb reverse. Is this okay? Oh my god! It's fucking annoying! Every single time I try to summon fucking you, Bell. No, 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 no. Fine. There goes two of my fucking limit reverses, like, every single time! God, that's annoying! Back row's not even back row, it's just fucking shit to stop me from fucking summoning you bell. It's really getting irritating. I just want to summon my fucking you bell. Is that so much? Now I gotta summon with goddamn Call of the Haunted. Who the fuck wants to do that? God. Oh my god. I can make a Felgran. I can make a Draco Sack. No, I can't make a Draco Sack. Do I have Armageddon Night Grave? No, I never got Armageddon Night Grave because I never got Armageddon Night Grave for this entire fucking duel. Ah! <sighs> you know what? I'm gonna call the Haunted back fucking one of these Summon Galaxy Wizard and Ixi into King of Feral Limb. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll fucking do that. Oh my god. That way I can get another mass chameleon. Every single time. Every single time. It's like if it's another token trap's done. Nope, it's just a fucking Entrez MST, just as fucking good. And he didn't set it that turn either. So of course I would have called him out on it, but nope. He just had it. Attack your monster. Okay. Does he have any kind of effect or anything? Anybody just card to push someone Cyber Dragon Monster from your deck? Okay. That's fine. Ah. Uh, go ahead. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. If he wants to use the core effect, I summon a Cyber Dragon from his deck. He can. If King Fairy Limp lasts another turn, yeah, he does, yay. I can go ahead and get my effect. Oh, message in a bottle. I'm just not sure if I have different levels right now. I have to check. Oh, Valor, sure. Uh, yeah, I do. I have one, two, three, yeah, three different levels. Yes, I do. God, this guy just has all the answers. Uh, God, I wish I had fucking... I can make a super Chachki Clutch cover, or I can make a Gustav Max. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. Yeah, message in a bottle. It's like a balanced version of Soul Charge. I'll summon Krebin's back. I'll summon Ubel back. I'll summon Phantom of Chaos back. Activate Galaxy Queen's Light. All 10. And we'll fucking overlay these two into a Gustav Max. I wish I was running fucking Gungura right now, but I'm not. So I guess we'll just go ahead and go for Gustav Max. Now at least I have you Bell in the field, and if you Bell gets killed, I can go ahead and summon Terror, because its effect is negated by message in a bottle, so that's good. Yeah, uh, all their attacks are from zero, also their effects are negated. If you knock out some of this turn using those three monsters, I have to use all three monsters, or just the three monsters, I don't know how this works. I don't know if it has to be all three monsters or just XC summon in general. I don't know. I'd have to look the ruling up on that. Eh, whatever. 
I didn't know it had to be all three monsters. I it just had to be XC Summon in general. Maybe it's something that I should see on fucking Dev Pro. Is Battle Phase over? Oh yeah, it does end Battle Phase. I thought it just blocked that particular attack. No, Battle Phase ends. My bad, I read it wrong. Yeah, I have to look it up. I don't think Akashi's style said anything about it either. Hmm. I have to see. I mean, you could substitute it for Soul Charge, but I'm not. That's not the point. Fucking Soul Charge, we already know Soul Charge is broke. So, yeah, I'd have to look that up. If you guys know, go ahead and tell me. But if it has to be all three monsters, then it's kind of like, eh, because now I can only make fucking... I can either make Hard Earth or Gungurda or something like that, or, you know. I mean, not Gungurda, fucking, uh, Galaxy Destroyer. Why am I thinking about Gungurda? I don't know who the fuck that is. You know, it has to be these two, if it has to be all three of them. Or I'm taking 5,000 to the chin, and that fucking hurts. 4,000 to the chin. Uh, that would just straight up kind of ruin the deck. That's actually one of the plays to just summon back you Bell next. See with these two, and then leave you Bell there. So if you Bell gets destroyed, cause their effect is negated. So I'm distributing during the end phase, and destroying gets like it's summon terror. Wait, no, you need a Cyber Dragon on the field. Yeah, you need a Cyber Dragon on the field. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, you need a Cyber Dragon on the field. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so used to just getting rid of the machines on the field, but he needs a Cyber Dragon while on the field. He needs Cyber Dragon plus some machines. So if he wants to go special summon Cyber Dragon, then do that, then that's fine. Mm hmm. What the fuck is this? Fucking DNA surgery? Mm-hmm. If this is DNA surgery, I'm a smack a bitch. So he's 2,000? Yeah. Yeah, it's 2,000. Ugh. You got anything else up your sleeve, or is that it? Because Gustav Max just happened to be a machine. At least he didn't have DNA surgery, because that would just suck ass. Uh, this duel is irritating. What? My monsters aren't machine. Aren't machines. Why would it be all my monsters? One's a reptile and one's a fiend. Where did you get all my monsters aren't machine? The only one that's machine was Gustav Max, unless you have DNA surgery. You have DNA surgery and you call machines, then we're all machines, but no. This is a reptile and this is a fiend. Yeah, yeah. What's this? Fucking Gustav Max is a machine. Gustav Max was a machine. Yeah, I know. 
Gustav Max was a machine. That's who you fused with. You fused with Gustav Max. That's how you summon that. If you tried to do that, and it wasn't, if Gustav Max wasn't a feeling you tried to do that, clearly I wouldn't allow you. You fused, you fused with Gustav Max only. It was the only machine on the field besides Cyber. To get all my monsters, you have to play DNA surgery. How do you spell surgery? Sur surgery. Surgery. Sur surgery. And call machines. Like, you thought you just fused with all my monsters on the field? No, 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 no. Still is taking a long time. I still gotta record daily duels. You okay, my Bell? Sure. Effect. Since I resolve in grave. Oh, you got something for that too. That's solemn warning. Yeah, he just said that this turn. Shouldn't have an answer. Yeah, he just said that this turn. Oh, I've been paying attention. So I'm gonna tear. Unless he has Didi Crow. No, even Didi Crow wouldn't stop it. Does it have to be uh, Skullmeister? Yeah. Skullmeister. Now, Skullmeister, when effect tries to activate, you pitch it and you negate. But if he has that, then he just, he's just running shit that he just should not be running. Middle Reflex Slime. Alright, awesome. Alright, well, I got nothing to do besides attack you. So if you want to go ahead and play anything, play Honest or whatever, I don't care. Take 300. Fat Terror Wipe. Go ahead. <clears throat> Alright. So I got any plans right now? I'm trying to think if I have any ideas or plans right now. Any upcoming C's or anything like that? Foolish. Seven hundred. Okay, I'm trying to think if I can pull off a chocolatey fudge covered. <laughs> what core effect? And a summon cyber dragon. Has there really only been two cyber dragons? Yeah, it has. He's just been using them wisely. They're still in his deck too. That's a shocking thing. Never drew them. He drew one cyber and cored the other two. That's pretty good. Ah, uh, that's fine. Yep, oh, still gonna stall. Fact. Go ahead and play fiendish or breakthrough or whatever. Okay, sure, monster. Cyber. There is a reason why my King of Ferland died last turn. Unless you want to play something in response and negate my effect. <coughs> you can destroy it at any time, sir. 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 Sir, destroy your monster, sir. Sir. Thank you. This video's taking forever. Especially since I ain't drawn shit. <laughs> Another metal reflex line. Well, at this point, the only fucker I can go for would be chocolate fudge covered. Right now, anyway. Yeah. Where the fuck is Dark Greffer and Armageddon Knight? Like, where the hell are they? 
There you are. I've been waiting for you. Shit. Where the hell have you been? Like, I run three Armageddon Knights, three Dark Grafters, two Rodas. Where the fuck? One Foolish. Like, you guys are supposed to be my graveyard keepers, and you guys aren't doing shit. Look at them pulling all the fucking bottom. Some bubble eater. Go ahead and use background him if you want to. I don't really care. Phase effect. Go ahead and kill him. Alright, well, if I make a super, super chocolatey fudge cover right now and wipe his background, that would be game. So. Just I'm not sure if I'll be able to pull it off. So far, he really hasn't been activating a lot of backgrounds with a lot of, you know, background hate, MSTs, traps, sounds like that, so. Mm-hmm. That's fine. Oh. Okay. I almost hit L1, almost hit every letter in the damn alphabet except for K. Uh, I don't know what to do for my side deck, for my competitive deck. I got the side deck cards, I just don't know how many I want to run or what. No. Yeah. I should do a separate video about it, asking you guys about it. I mean, I got them. I got, I got, you know, I got the maxis. I got the debunks. I got the, I got the black horns. Or just, I don't know how many to run and what else to run. Uh, that is, that is, the, that is the part where we're, I'm still trying to figure it out. You know, you're supposed to add the spell card, right? Spell a trap card. Okay, then you're gonna use Cyber Repair Plant to get Dre, Dre or Zoe, or fuck. There, there's too many. I think it's I think it's Zoe, isn't it? He's in here, right? No, it's Dre. And who's Zoe? Zoe's the other one that no one runs. the deck then he's gone through. I'm not surprised he doesn't have uh, Honest yet. So far I've been attacking his machines and he's just been taking it. No Honest. Really surprising. Still is taking forever. We're already approaching fucking half an hour. Like, come on. Thank you. Galaxy Queen's Light. Well, that works. I can make a Draco Smack and Draco Smack can destroy... My, uh, my terror. I'm just having ultimate nightmare. Mm. That might be for the best. So I don't continuously get fucking wiped by his back row. Because that's starting to get a pain in the dick. If he lets me do it, I can call the hunted summon, uh, summon, uh, Galaxy Wizard, Galaxy Wizard, go up to 8, level Eater, Eater, level up, Galaxy Queen's Light, make them both 7. See you in Draco Sack, Draco Sack, pop, summon. Then I still got a Metal Flex Slime, another Metal Flex Slime, another Limit Reverse. Ah. Uh, I got plays, just. Or should I just eat Ebo's level until. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Level Eater. Fact. Now terror is uh, ten. If only I had a normal summon that I can normal summon because I don't have a normal summon right now. Uh, yeah, you know what? I got a limit reverse. That's fine. That's what I call haunted. Okay. Sure. Oh, it's stuck on the field. My bad. Oh, no, not banish. Fuck. I keep misclicking. He's just filling up my fucking back row with fucking just, uh... Uh, shit. Hold on. Hold on. Uh... Uh... Chain... Uh... Metal flux line. Chain. Unless you want chain response. Okay.
wait, wait, mm, wait, that's outside the train. Alright, you want to, wait, 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 if you seven tools now, you will be negating your threatening. Because that's the last chain to activate. Cause... No, hold on, hold on. I activate call, you activate trap stun, I activate uh, metal flex time, you activate threatening roar. If you activate th seven tools, you would be negating the last tra trap that is activated. Okay. Okay. So, that's not activated, because that's not even at the chain. Well, you can't chain threaten threatening to seven tools. So you would have to activate it uh, at end of main phase. You can't just flip a card really nilly because you can't chain threatening to it. Seven tools is spell speed three, threatening is only spell speed two. Alright, that's fine. Uh, I don't really got any more plays right now. Oh, I'll just set these two. Guess I'll do the play next turn. Because I can't do it this turn. I mean, I can, but I don't have any more 10s. The only 10 I had was Gustav Max. Which I'm thinking about switching for Gungurta, because Gungurta is better, in my opinion, right now. Can't summon you, because I still have that. You're still stuck in my hand. Can't use you, can't use you, can't use you, can't attack. So, yeah, I'll just, I'll just set the matter reflect slime and deal with it next turn. Effect. Go ahead. Ah. This duel is w taking way too long. At this rate, I can fucking deck him out if I want to. Yeah, he has all the answers. He's been having the, all the answers this entire duel. So let's say, oh, trap stun? That's great. Now I'll fucking flip up this and make a fucking and kill you. But nope. I got the answers. I got the answers right here. I wonder if that's another fucking threatening roar. So we have to find out. So I'll activate Rota. Go ahead and search for Dark Greffer. No. No, not Dark Greffer. That's all I need is Armageddon Knight. Yeah, all I need is Armageddon Knight. I don't need Dark Greffer. Ah, uh, but if I eat a level off fucking Yubel, then he'll go. Then Yubel will go down to 9, because he's at. I guess I got to be at the Metal Reflex time again, but. Uh, Yeah, you know what, fuck it. Activate my fuck sign. Okay. Or you got another fucking seven tools for me. Or trap stun. Alright. 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 All the fucking answers. I'm gonna get a knight. Fact. <sighs> this tool's annoying. And it's long! And Longhorn. Seriously, answers for days. Every time I play something, answers, 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 answers. So if I eat a level off right now. You know what? I'm gonna poke you with Armageddon. Oh, no. Oh, first level eater. Yep, I got something. I got something. I got something. I will attack for 2,000. You won't have answers for this. You won't have answers for this. You're gonna learn today. You're gonna learn today. I'm gonna win this goddamn duel. I'm tired of this shit. All nine? Let's do this. We're actually summoning him. The card who... who sh We shall not speak his name because he rarely gets summoned. What the fuck? Overlay. Overlay.
Hard Earth. I did it. Set one, pass. So if you try to play or set anything during your end phase, I'm going to detach, banish all that shit, summon Mass Chameleon, Mass Chameleon, summon back Phantom Chaos, and game. God. And when he comes back, he's going to be a 3,000 beater because of fucking core. If he gets destroyed, that'd be cool. Ooh, that heart earth, though. Effect. Banish. Banish. During your end phase. Banish. And then now when he comes back, he'll be 5,000. That too. That's set. Banish all cards your opponent currently controls that were normal summon special summon set. Yep. Draw. Oh, hi, Kirby Bandit. Right, normal summon you. Effect. Go ahead and bring back Phantom of Chaos. Unless he wants to Veiler. Unless he wants to Veiler. Response. Yep. Yep. My computer is lagging like fuck. Like, like, god damn, what the fuck is going on? I typed in yup and shit's not typing. Oh my god, computer. Like, what the fuck is on? I have way too much shit open right now. Come on. Sure, GG. Alright, shit I'm typing is not popping up. Oh my god. Whew, did you see that? The fucking lag is just ridiculous. Whew. Yeah. I wasn't gonna play with him. I was just gonna summon back. He went to weather. Fine, check. It's been over. Alright. So, the computer is lagging like crazy. This video is way too long, and yeah. But I did it. So, not really sure how I feel about the Cory Bandit. Really didn't get to utilize his full strength, but, uh Thinking about if there's any other standalone level threes. I'm thinking, I was thinking about Gale, and then I was also thinking about uh, uh, Dark Resonator. You know, the level three tuner that can block an attack that can't be destroyed by once per turn. Thinking about him too. So I also need to put in Goyle. All right. So this fight did actually help me this duel, uh, Vulcan, but Goyle. So thank you guys for uh, watching this video. Thank you guys for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with Cosmic Key Bell. Thanks for watching.